hi let's see how to fix the cod warzone 3 class play not working call of duty warzone is one of the most popular games out there and cross play is an essential feature that enables the players on the different platforms to play together however many players have experienced the issues with the cross play not working in the cod warzone 3 if you are a, someone facing this issue then don't worry we have got you covered so let's see what causes the cod warzone 3 cross play not working the first cause is settings configuration issues the second cause is outdated game version of the cod the third cause is network issues the fourth cause is server outages in the cod the fifth cause is platform specific glitches so let's see how to fix the cod warzone 3 cross play not working the first method is check the server status of the cod always try to check the server status of the cod before trying any kind of troubleshooting methods in the website downdetector.com okay so if there is any kind of maintenance is going on just wait for some time then you can try again later the second method is check the crossplay settings in the cod ensure that the crossplay is enabled in the game settings navigate to the option menu in the game and look for the icon tab here you should find the crossplay settings and make sure that it is turned on the third method is check for your network connection Make sure that you have a proper internet connection with very good speed and very good bandwidth. If you are having a poor internet connection, try to reset your router or the modem. Okay, so by going to the website pass.com, you can check the speed of your internet connection. Okay, some of the troubleshooting methods what you can follow is like just try to reset your router or the modem that will fix any kind of box or the glitches present in your internet connection. Okay, so if you're still facing the issue, you can contact the internet service provider for further assistance. They have the expertise, they will help you to fix any kind of network problem. The fourth method is adjust NAT type settings. When you are experiencing the issues with the COD Warzone 3 crossplay not working, adjusting your network access translation type settings can be a critical help in the troubleshooting connectivity problems. Your NAT type influences how easily you can connect with the other players with an open NAT type allowing the most seamless interaction. Okay, so navigate to your router settings page and find the UPnP settings and enable the UPnP and reboot your router. The fifth method is to port forwarding when it comes to improve your Call of Duty Warzone gaming experience. Setting up the port forwarding on your router can be a crucial step. This process helps establish a direct line of communication between your console or the PC and the game servers, potentially reducing the lobby wait times and improving the connection stability. Okay. So, locate and the port forwarding section of your router setting center the appropriate port numbers of the COD version. Okay, so finally, you can assign them the console or uh, assign to your console or the PC IP address, apply the changes, and reboot your router to ensure the settings take effect. The sixth method is update the COD version 3. Some of the simplest step what you can do is like just try to update the COD version 3 to the latest version. If you are using the older or the outdated version, you will face these kind of issues. Okay, so make sure that you are using the latest or the updated version for the PlayStation or for Xbox or for the PC, whether it can be Battle.net or for the PC with the Steam. Okay. The seventh method is uninstall and reinstall the COD version 3. Okay, so if the other troubleshooting methods didn't work for you, you can just uninstall the COD Warzone 3 and then again you can reinstall it by downloading from where you are downloaded previously. Okay, so once you uninstall it, you can just try to just you can just try to restart your system or the device. Once you have restarted your device, just try to reinstall it by downloading from where you have downloaded previously whether it can be App Store or the Google Store or the Play Store. Okay, on the PlayStation or on the Xbox or on the Battle.net or the X on the Steam. Okay, and the eighth method is contact the support team of the COD. If you have tried all other troubleshooting steps and if you're still facing the problem, you can contact the support team of the COD. They are the, they are the expertise. They will help you to fix the problem and they will give you the better solution. You can contact them through either the live chat service or you can contact them through by raising the ticket. So once you raise the ticket, the backend technical team, they will get back to you and they will come up with a solution. Okay. So that's all about this. Thank you.